record. All right, we are recording. So here's what it is. First, what I want to show you is you have to, uh, let me say, uh, decide what which one is your stance. So usually, okay, usually, if I have a, uh, I am right-handed, okay, right-handed. So I'm right-handed. If I get a ball and I want to throw as far as I can, I will put my right my right side on the on the back, and then I will throw. Okay, to get a better strength. Right? I would not throw like this. Right? With no. Okay. Although sometimes kids might do this. So with that said, okay, your stance first. Put your feet. Okay, your shoulders with it not too wide open, not too close either, just here, regular, okay? Then you step your, your, your dominant side back. In my case, is my right, okay? Good. And that alone is your, let's say your safe stance. If somebody's coming at you, it's too close to you, that's your safe stance. Put your hands up, okay? Open your hands, don't make a fist, just hands, right? Because you don't want to communicate anything. Right, uh, you don't want to communicate that you're ready to fight. Just you know, and keep telling them, "Hey, I don't want, I don't want anything. Get away from me. You know, you're getting too close. I don't like that." Right? Always that six feet from the coronavirus that can we can use that, right? Well, but of course, it's even more. Okay, even more. Actually, six feet is getting too close already. Okay, so stay there. Okay, good. But very similar to it, you close your fist, put closer to your to your chin, just like touching my chin, okay? And your elbows are closed. And imagine you have a, a ping pong ball on your on your throat here in your chin and you're holding a ping pong ball. Because if you do like this, now your hands are not protecting you. The hands are up, but the, your chin is even over. Okay, so you're here, all right? So now the first punch is called the jab. It's from the leading side. I have a leading side and I have a rear side. The leading and the, the punch is going to come like this. I'll, I'll, be, I'll turn sideways. Look, comes, rotate, and come back. I'm not doing this. I know it's, it's like I'm poking, right? I'm poking. Okay. So you go and back and see how my, my fist ends right there. Could that even rotate like this? But this one, no good. Okay. So go here, rotates a little bit. And here, this is called the jab. Got it? We're gonna do this 10 times, ready? And go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good, now Destiny, uh, was that your right hand? Yes, your, your right hand is in front, is in front or is in, is in the back? Back, so, uh, that's supposed to be with the other hand then, okay? I just can't see your legs, all right? So the jab is the left hand. If Actually, let me start uh, speaking properly, okay? Uh, even help you guys better. So now, if you are right-handed, okay? It's gonna be your right hand now and it's on the, on the rear. That's called a cross, okay? It's called a cross. I rotate a little, see? That one from the rear here and I rotate my ankle, okay? 10 times, it's called the cross, ready guys? Go one, two, three, four, good. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, very good. Now, we are gonna do a hook, leading hook, leading leg hook, left hook if you are right-handed. Left hook if you are right-handed right hook if you are left-handed, you understand? Ready, and go one, good, two, left, three, four, five, six, seven. Look at my hook, bent a little bit, you see that? Bent a little bit, and my elbow is not lower than my shoulder right here, okay? Good, seven, eight, nine, and 10, good. That is a rotation here, you see that? It's a rotation. Okay, other than that, it's just arm. See my body, All right? Yes, gotta rotate, good. Let's do the same thing with the rear, okay? Ready, go one and two and three, good. Four, my elbow, same side, same height on my shoulder, five, 
Good, six, make a fist, seven, good, eight, nine, and 10, very good. Now we're gonna do uppercuts, okay? Uppercuts, ready, go, one, good, two, same side, left side, front side, okay? It's my front leg, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, good. Now we're gonna do rear side, ready? And go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Very good, very nice. Now we're gonna, we're gonna practice defenses from these punches, okay? So if I'm throwing a jab and I am right-handed, I am, a, a, yes, right-handed, so my jab is on my left. You see that is my left. And then it's gonna come on this side here. So therefore I protect with my right, okay? So I'm protecting the jab that comes this way with my right. You guys got it? If you are, depending if you are independently, if you are right hand or left hand at this time, it doesn't matter, okay? It doesn't matter. So here it is, look, let me get the dummy here. I do the jab usually in the middle of the guy's face, but he's gonna protect with that hand there, which is his right. Okay, his right, got it? So here it is. How are you gonna do this? You do like a shield, okay? The hands are already here, this, this, you're gonna block, okay? Ready, 10 times, go one, two, three, Four, good, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Now the cross. Defend with the other arm. Ready? Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Now the leading hook. The leading hook. Leading hook, leading hand, leading side, hook. I defend like that because it's coming from that way. So like answer in the phone, but a little higher, a little bit more past your ear, okay? So we are here coming that way. One, two, good, three. Everyone with your right, four, right hand, five, good. Six, seven, eight, good, nine, and 10, good. Now the re the other hook coming that way. It's coming right, somebody's lapping me this way. I got a block. Okay, ready, go one, good. Two, your left, three, good. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, very good. Now uppercut, someone is gonna come here and uppercut, uppercut. This hand here is closer, so I'm gonna defend. Defending with your right. So how you do this? You cross your elbow in front of your body, okay? Yes, because it's gonna hit, it's gonna come here and can hit even your chin. Okay, ready, go. One, two, three, good. Four, five, six, seven, eight, good. Nine and 10, very nice. Now, from the other side, here. Okay, the other uppercut. Ready, go one, two, good, three, good, four, five, six, seven, good, eight, nine, and 10. Very nice. Good, now we're gonna do uh, some kicks, okay? Some kicks, we're gonna start with knees, okay? And we go, we go uh, further on. I, I, I have to say that some of the kicks that we do here, maybe I would not recommend for you to do in a self-defense situation, okay? But many of the kicks are also, I say, important to practice so you get a better uh, motor skill, okay? And of course, why I'm saying don't do this kick? Because it requires more training, but some kicks are just easier, okay? The knees are fine. So the knees are how we're gonna do here, okay? You're gonna raise, put on the floor, raise the other leg, put on the floor, and so on. 20, uh, 10 times, ready? Go one, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So I hold the guy's head, right? And then I knee. Okay, hold his head and then I knee. Got it? So that's uh, nice. That's it. Very good. So now we're going to do the side knee. Same thing as side knee. Very similar. I hold his head and the knee comes from side, from the side. Okay, that's how you do the knee. And we're gonna put the hands like that, one on top of the other. So your knee comes from outside here, put on the floor. Got it? Let's count to 10, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Very good, nice. Okay, very good. Now we're gonna do a push kick. What's a push kick? When you push the guy away. Push kick now is not as great for self-defense because you you know you raise your leg too much, you can fall. But very similar to the push kick is the snap kick. What is the snap kick? I raise and then I snap. I raise and then I snap, okay? The push kick, I push the person away. This is a push kick. Push the person away, got it? So that's what we're gonna practice, okay? We're gonna do this 20 times. Ready? Good, and go. One, two, three, four, five. Push the person away. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Very good. Next kick is. The round, kick, the side kick, I'm sorry, okay? And the side kick, very similar to the push kick, but it's sideways. And again, it requires more training. So I wouldn't tell you to, I wouldn't ask you to do a push kick at anyone in self-defense. You would do a snap kick to the groin and you would do a knee if you're in a close distance, all right? Nothing else. But all the others are gonna make you better. So a side kick is this side kick, all right? So side kick the person. We're gonna do side to side, okay? So how? Bend, extend here. Then the other side, bend, extend. But we do fast, right? Ready? Go one, two, good. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good. We gotta be careful to not just lift, right? We gotta make sure we push it. Good. Now we're gonna do the rear kick or the back kick, I'm sorry. The back kick, usually, how does it happen? I go one, two, I punch, I put a combination, then I turn, I kick someone behind, and then I'm back, right? That's how, but we're not gonna do this way. We're just gonna be here and we're gonna kick back, look over the shoulder, kick, right? Look over the shoulder kick, all right? And you're gonna try to kick in the same spot right there, not kicking two, two guys, all right? Two different first, okay? Ready and go. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, nice, six, seven, eight, nine, good job, and 10. Now we just need to be careful, not turning too much because then it's a side kick, right? If I turn too much, just a little bit over the shoulder. Got it? Very good. Now the last one, round kick. One of the most famous kicks in uh, kickboxing, Muay Thai, all this, uh, uh, how do you say, uh, uh, modalities, right? So how are we gonna do this? Same thing, keep your foot parallel. What we are doing is beginner's drill, okay? So could have more details into the thing, but we just try to get better as a beginner, okay? So how? I'm gonna step to the side and then I kick. And my kick comes like this, okay? Then I step to the other side and kick, all right? So imagine my shin is a baseball bat and I'm hitting someone like that. I'm not scraping up, okay? So here, here, if you kick wrong, you're scraping up, no good, right? So what you need to do is to kick and turn. So I turn my foot that way and I turn and then I'm back, All right? So my knee, my knee turned that way and back. 
Got it? If your knee is pointing up, the kick is going to go up. All right? How are we going to practice that? Here. Here, we're going to go one, two, three, and so on. Got it? Be ready. Okay? And go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Nice. Very good. Very good. Okay. Now. We're gonna work on a combination. What's combinations? Two punches together, just punches first. All right, so show me your stance. Remember, here's your safe stance. Do not, let get, do not let people get close to you. Move back, if you need to move back, not a straight line. You always kind of move back sideways so you can see what's going on behind you. Sideways, right? If you need to move back from someone, got it? You're going to have a situation that you're going to be here too as well. You're moving back from someone. And then you need to learn how to get up. We will have that as well. You can't just get up like this. Somebody's going to come and kick you. Okay, that is a proper way to get up. Got it? So that's it. And that's it. Now what are we going to do? I am right-handed. My left leg is in front of me. Okay? I'm going to do jab and cross. Jab and cross, leading and rear, okay? 10 times, ready, you go one, two, three, go four, five, jab, cross, six, jab, cross, seven, jab, cross, good, eight, jab, cross, nine, jab, cross, and 10, jab, cross, good, very nice. Now we're, now we're gonna do cross and hook, okay? Cross, rear, rear punch, and hook, front side, okay? Right and left, in my case, okay? Ready, go one, cross, hook, two, cross, hook, good, three, cross, hook, four, cross, hook, five, cross, hook, six, cross, hook, seven, cross, hook, eight, cross, hook, nine, cross, hook, and 10, cross, hook, very good, nice. Okay, now we do hook and hook. Front hook, rear hook, okay? Ready, and go one, two, nice, three, four, five, hook, hook, six, hook, hook, good, seven, hook, hook, eight, hook, hook, nine, hook, hook, and 10, hook, hook, very nice, good job. Now we're gonna do rear hook and front uppercut, okay? Ready, go one, rear hook, front uppercut, good. Two, rear hook, front uppercut, nice. Three, rear hook, front uppercut. Four, rear hook, front uppercut. Five, rear hook, front uppercut. Six, rear hook, front uppercut, good, seven, rear hook, front uppercut, and eight, rear hook, front uppercut, nine, rear hook, front uppercut, and 10, rear hook, front uppercut. Very good, All right? So, so far, we did four combinations. Com combo one, jab, cross. Combo two, cross, hook. Combo three, hook, hook. Combo four, hook, uppercut, okay? Now, combo five, uppercut, uppercut. Leading and rear. Ready, go one, bam, bam, okay? And two, left, right, good. Three, left, right, good. Four, left, right, good. Five, left, right. Six, left, right, good. Seven, left, right. And eight, left, right, good. Nine, left, right. And 10, left, right, good, that's it. All right, so we did five combinations. Now we're gonna add some kicks. But we're not going to do 10, we're going to do only five, okay? So now it's going to be combination six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, all right? Combination six is the combo one plus a kick. Look at that. Jab, cross, then I will step with my rear leg, and then I kick with my left. 
okay? Jab, cross, get, have this in your mind. Jab, cross, step, and kick with your left, okay? Ready, go. Jab, cross, step, kick left, good. Two, jab, cross, step right, kick left, good. Three, jab, cross, step right, kick left, good. Four, jab, cross, step right, kick left, good. And five, jab, cross, step right, kick left. Nice, very good, very good. Now we're gonna do combo six, cross, hook, kick right, okay? Right, left, kick right. Ready? Show me your stance. Good. Okay. And one. Cross, hook, kick right. Good. Two. Right, left, kick right. Good. Three. Right, left, kick right. Good. Four. Right, left, kick right. Good. Five. Right, left, kick right. Good. We did five, very good, we did five, good. Now, we are gonna do combo seven, okay? Combo seven is easy. The only thing that is hard, or might be hard or different, let's put it this way, is the switch. So let's practice this one here, look. All right? let's do it 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good, that's it. So here is how I'm gonna do. Hook, front one, hook, hook, switch, kick. That's all. Why you switch? You put this leg here, back, so I can make a harder kick. You understand? Yes, but I will say, you just follow me, ready? Left, right, good, switch, kick left. Nice. Again, two, left, right, switch, kick left. Nice. Three, left, right, switch, kick left. Good. Nice. Four, left, right, switch, kick left. Good. And five, left, right, switch, kick left. Good. Nice. Very good. So this was combo eight. Now combo nine. Rear hook, front uppercut. I will switch and I do a side knee on the first. So let me get my dummy. Rear hook, front uppercut, switch, side knee. Rear hook, front uppercut, switch, side knee. Okay? Side knee can be to the stomach, to the ribs here, or to the head, to the chin, okay? Five times, ready? One, rear hook, front uppercut, switch, side knee, nice. Two, rear hook, front uppercut, switch, side knee, good. Three, rear hook, front uppercut, switch, side knee, good. Four, rear hook, Front of a cut, switch, side knee. Nice, last one, five. Rear hook, front of a cut, switch, side knee. Good, very nice. Now last one, last combination, okay? Is gonna be front of a cut, rear of a cut, hold the guy's head and throw a knee. So it's gonna be left, right, and then right. Guys, the only thing I'm saying here is for a right-handed person. If you are left-handed, then you do the opposite of what I'm telling you, okay? All right? But so far, those who are in the camera here, okay, are all righty, and I can uh, communicate to you guys. The other I can't see, okay? The class before this class, we had six people with the camera on, five were right-handed, and one was left-handed, and it was possible to correct that person, and she did pretty well. Okay, just by using this, uh, how you say, uh, fundamental principle, I use, how you say, use the opposite of what I say, all right? 
Good. So here's what we're going to do. Yeah. So front uppercut, rear uppercut, hold the person's head, throw a knee. All right. Front uppercut, rear uppercut, hold the person's head, throw a knee. Got it? Okay. Ready? And go one. Front, rear, hold, knee. Nice. Is that right knee? Good. Two, left, right, hold, right knee. Nice. Three, left, right, hold, right knee. Good. Four, left, right, hold, right knee. Good. And five, left, right, hold, right knee. Very nice, guys. Good work. Good work. Okay. So now we can put this away. All right, very nice. And let me just stop here. Okay.